back to my channel. Thanks for clicking and watching. So today I'm in a little dress. It's New Year's Eve. This is Shay. Look at we just decided to dress up. We have for no, ourselves. For ourselves. We're gonna go into the new year looking hot. Exactly. We have no place to go, but we want to feel good. We're just gonna chill out. Leo's gonna come over and we're just gonna, you know, have a little few drinks and just feel good about ourselves. But a kiki night. A little kiki night. I want to show you guys. Yeah. We're little twins with our black dresses with our little cute touch up, you know, nothing too much. And then I have my little pigtails and she has her natural. We're natural girls. Na natural. natural girls. But yeah, I just wanted to give you an update. Hope you guys are having an amazing new year. Hey guys, so today I am going to just review some of Aritzia's popular winter coats. So today I'm going to do a review of the Duvet Puffer Short versus the Mega Puff versus the Super Puff Regular. So let's see which one's better, which one's worth it, and which one's my favorite. So I'm actually going to start off with the Duvet Puffer just because this is the one that I actually have. My friends have the other ones. Um, this is the one that I got just because I thought it was a little bit different. Um, and yeah, I got it in... I forget, but I will pop it up. So this is how... This is how it looks open. It does come like, you know, it's short. It's not like cropped where it's like up here. It does come at like just a normal kind of coat length. I do have another coat super long, but you know, you like to, I just want to have variation in my coats and I'll always have coats down to my ankles or past my knees. So this is more chill. Um, the pockets are lined, so they're nice and warm and it does have a zipper pocket, not like a button pocket, but that is the only zipper on the coat. To close the coat, it's actually a bunch of buttons. So as you can see, there's a button here, close that. A button here, close that, and then so on. So you just keep closing the buttons up until, yeah, I think that's the last button. So there's about one, two, three, four buttons on this coat. And then it's like that big hood. So it's a cute, fun hood. You feel warm, you feel nice. Um, I really like this coat. I mean, it does the job. It's warm. The only annoying thing I would say is like, why is there no zipper? But I haven't had a problem. Like, I haven't felt like, ooh, the wind is is coming through. Maybe if it was the longer one, like the duvet long, maybe then it would you would feel that gaping in between. But because it's so short, and then I obviously like wear like a hoodie or something underneath, I don't feel that coldness. Um, but yeah, if you do like a zipper, then I would say this is probably not the coat for you because it could become tedious always buttoning it and then having to like open it and then, oh shoot, I have to button it again. So that's the only tedious thing, but it is super warm. It um, has the down fill, responsibly sourced down. And yeah, I just like that the pockets are lined and there's zipper clothes and I like that big hood. Um, but yeah, this is, I, I have been enjoying this coat. I just got it this year and I really liked it and I like the color. Um, so yeah. Moving on, this is actually the Mega Puff. So it does look very similar to the Super Puff, I would say. Um, but this is the Mega Puff in a size two. The Duvet Puffer that I got was actually a size small. Uh, extra small just fit a little too tight. Small is better. I just liked a bit oversized and if I was gonna do anything. This again is not mine, it's my friend's. So. Maybe I would have gotten a size one, but I actually don't mind that look of the two. So this has a zipper close to the top. It actually does come with a hood, but they removed it. Um, and then the collars, it's like a Velcro collar. So just it's like tight in there. That's always a good because the wind does seep through. Um, my duvet puffer doesn't have it, but again, I haven't really noticed that. Um, but it is obviously features like this is always really good to have this is super puffy i would say this is warmer i already feel a bit like i'm getting hot in this coat so this would is warmer than the duvet again the pockets are lined and there is a zipper close so this is definitely a good option maybe if you don't want the super puff because everyone has it i don't know the mega puff is really good and it does kind of look the same but yeah, this is this is definitely a cool, chill coat. Um, 
But which do I prefer? I don't know. I really do like the the look of the duvet puffer. So my fave so far is still the duvet puffer, but I do like the warmth of this coat and the extra features to make it a little bit more warm. Again, um, it even has like a secret pocket inside. Um, and yeah, there's no necessarily like that lining inside of either of the coats. They're both kind of like that same material on the inside and the outside. And yeah, this is how it looks open. Last but not least, the Super Puff, probably something you guys have all been waiting for. This is the Super Puff in an extra small. Ooh, this one you can tell. It seems better quality than them all. There's just something about the Super Puff. This one has uh, the thumbs cutouts. I'm not sure if the older versions do or the newer versions do. But this has the thumb cutout, and it even has like a little sleeve inside, so it feels so nice. Like it just sucks you in. It feels really good. Um, I believe this is, I don't know if this is the high gloss. I'll have to double check because if you guys can see, there's a, a little bit of a sheen. It's not the matte super puff. Um, but yeah, so this one has a zipper, and it has buttons. After you want to zip, you can button it up throughout. It does come with the hood. Um, but people a lot of the time just remove the hood, so she removed it as well. The pockets are lined, but there's no zipper. These ones are actually like a button close for the zipper. Just that one button. This one, feel, okay guys, I, I don't have a super puff. I never planned on really getting a super puff. But <laughs> like just wearing this, I can already tell the difference in quality. I feel very warm. It feels just so good quality. It feels so soft somehow, even though it's a winter coat. I love the sleeves right here that just give you that extra warmth and comfort. They're also very soft. I love the thumb cutout. This, oh my gosh, honestly, the Super Puff is a winner. I wanted to be biased and say the coat I have, the duvet puffer is a winner, but this is definitely a winter coat. Now I understand why everyone in Toronto and Canada, now around the world, has this coat. I get it now guys I get it this is a very good coat so I found the hood it's just um it's not as big as like that duvet puffer hood it is a lot smaller um, but it's just like a regular kind of thing but this the hood is even puffy too like it's all and the whole coat is a big puff like a big freaking super <laughs> puff so and, and then it has like that TNA symbol on the coat um, this is a winner. Honestly, if you've been thinking about should I get the Super Puff, should I not? There's so many different variations. There's long, there's short, um, there's the regular, I think there's even a mid, and then there's the different materials. Maybe just play around with which materials that you want, but this is a good, this is a good standard practical winter coat. It's worth the money for sure. Um, it just feels good. Has even tightening things here. Has that zipper again. And then when you open the coat, it says TNA and it will say like the super puff. You can even get it personalized because I know everyone does have it. So I know there's a personalization option. So you can have your name actually written inside the coat. So yeah, if you have a lot of siblings that have it or maybe friends, you live with roommates and you don't want to get it confused, you can even get your name written inside the coat. But yeah, those are the difference between the duvet puffer, the mega puff, and the super puff. Um, I just wanted to do this video because I did ask if you guys wanted a little review and someone did actually say that they did. So thank you for engaging with my content. But I hope you guys enjoyed this little comparison. Super puff. Obviously everyone speaks about it, but they, it exceeded my, like this is a comfortable coat. I might even start wearing my friend's coat because what the hell is going on? I wouldn't bag on any of those coats. The Mega Puff was nice, the Duvet Puffer was great, but the Super Puff on its own, like I mean, it's just not a different standard for sure. It's just, this. it's the Super Puff. I get it now, I get it now. But again, I am a little bit biased, so I would say if you're not maybe wanting the Super Puff, maybe get the Duvet Puff, <laughs> but it's, it's not nearly as warm. I'm sorry, but it's, it's just not nearly as warm. And obviously that button closure is a tad annoying. It hasn't annoyed me. I can understand why it would annoy the regular person. Also, sorry if you don't like this angle. Um, I would have recorded differently, but our house, we kind of just got a few new things for the house. So there's kind of some boxes in random places. So I did want to give you something kind of nice to look at, but I feel like this was a really random angle.
guys don't mind the way I'm looking. It's just <laughs> comfy, cozy wear. Um, but yeah, I'm just with John and Shay. We decided to go out, get something to eat because it's in Ontario. It's actually the last day you can go out to eat. So ever, ever, ever. we've heard this before. Two weeks. We've heard that two week story before, and we know what it turned into. Two weeks turned into six months. Turned into one year. Turned into two years. <laughs> so yeah, we're just here now. The next day actually right now i'm just doing a mask it's a collagen rubber mask so i put the collagen on first to you know like a firming collagen and then this mask on top you're supposed to have it on for 30 to 40 minutes so that's what i'm gonna do i just want to show you guys that i'm serious about my skincare not really i'm trying to be 2022 is the year of clear skin right so Oh, and I just got my nails done actually. I wanted to do a pinky nude, but then the, the number didn't match up with the color. So when she went to get it, it was a whole different color. So I was like, okay, let me do maybe more brownie nude. Do you guys like this? I feel like I don't like it. Like, like it's growing on me. Not really, but I want it to. I feel like it just looks very subtle, very maybe classic, classy, but I'm not liking it. I just feel like what's happening with my nails. I'm not a super, super vibrant girl all the time, but I just like a nice clean nail or a nice fun color. And I don't think this is really giving either, but I don't know, maybe it's just me. Sorry, my mask is like, I think cause I'm talking, I'm ruining it. So you know what, let me just let this sit. <laughs> Let me just fix this, let it sit, and I'll either see you guys tonight or tomorrow. Also, I'm burning this candle that my sister got me and it smells so good. It's called White Winter. Ugh, I literally, I love it. Can you tell that I'm a fan of cherry pot? But yeah, this candle, I would recommend. I just walked into my room and I was like, <sighs> so good. Thank you, sister. Hi guys, so today is the next day. I'm actually about to head to my sister's house. We're just gonna, you know, spend the day together. It's about noon. I'm gonna head there now. I was actually going to take the subway, but I'm feeling kind of lazy and it's kind of cold. So I think I'm just gonna Uber. And yeah, before you say anything about my hair or you're like, girl, your hair's not even slicked down. Why does it have to be? I'm not trying to get into a deep combo right now or deep talks, but like, it's so annoying that black women's hair is such a big discussion and it's like for us to even be on camera, for us to go out, our hair has to be laid, like everything has to be slicked back proper. But like other people can just do their little messy bun, their little messy ponytail, walk out with the hair just got out the shower. I'm trying to be like that, so I don't really care. I don't feel like I need to have slick, slick do's. So yeah, I literally threw my hair in like some messy pigtails, didn't even put any edge control on, and I'm feeling good. This is my hair, this is how I look, and I don't really care. And yeah, my hair is short. Before you think about anything, think about yourself. Anyways, I'm gonna go there now. I just got to my sister's house, and look at this girl. She's like, I wanna whip up a quick snack. Wow, do you know how much they would sell that at Freaking pita, whatever. Pita pit? Pita pit. It looks really good. I'm gonna take a bite. Mmm. How much would you rate it out of 10? This is really good. And I use ground turkey instead of beef so it's leaner and healthier. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Really good. How much out of 10? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I would give it a solid... For a sandwich, like sandwich-wise, I'm gonna give it like an eight or nine. I knew you were gonna say that. Well, that's amazing. Maybe I'll have some later. <laughs> Hi, Lee. Hi, Levi. You're just the cutest little baby ever. Hi. Aren't you cute? Levi? Thank you guys for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It means a lot. I just wanna keep growing my channel. And I just wanna feel Good about. Sorry, I don't know why I always have to sing at the end. But uh, just like it, just comment, just subscribe. Just make a girl feel good. Come on. But I will see you guys next week. I obviously know that my Aritzia videos are kind of doing well. So if you do want to see more Aritzia videos, great. Just ask and you shall receive. Like this one, 
I do have a lot of Aritzia clothes, so maybe if you want to know about popular items and me to review those and do in-depth reviews and not vlogs and, and not um, clips of the vlog and just a whole video about an Aritzia item, I would be more than happy to do that. So let a girl know. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week. I hope you guys enjoyed. But yeah, go ahead and get yourself a super puff. Alright, bye guys.